media day is a fun, fun day for all the guys. Uh, we get to come in here and uh, we get a little break from camp, a little break from meetings, a break from practice. And we come in and, and we get dressed up in our jerseys, our, our game jerseys, which is always a, always a fun time putting those on. And uh, come in, take headshots. Uh, we go through our, our pre-game video uh, footage, uh, some of the kind of looking up like this what you guys see on the scoreboard that's all taped today and then uh, we take our team photo uh, with all the players and the coaches and that, that's a fun time oh we just get a chance to uh, talk about the team and you know what I'm saying? just express how, how much we love being here and you know just having fun and get a chance to actually just relax it's actually it's very relaxing to get a chance to just talk and have fun and talk to different people it's just good to talk to people that support you and that love what you do and get a chance to talk to the media, get a chance to get off the practice fields and stuff like that. So we really appreciate this day. I think this right here shows us like what we're looking forward to in the season and what people are actually looking for us and stuff. So this is going to push us to work even harder throughout the rest of the game. Kick off luncheon, we all sit down with all of our supporters and, um, and a lot of our fans and and our teammates and coaches, and it's really big for us because we feel we feel honored. It's always something we look forward to. It's always near the end of camp, so it's definitely something we look forward to. You know, when I first started doing it, I was like, man, this is kind of you know awkward. You know, sitting sitting down with a bunch of uh, people that I don't know, and you know, they obviously you know, a lot of them know each other. But as you sit there and you kind of go through all the things that, that are going on and the videos and you start talking, you know, eating and talking to the people. I think it's a really great experience. It's, uh, it's exciting each year. You have uh, a lot of interaction with the uh, players uh, since they're sitting at your table and the coach talks about the team. It's a great event. I'd recommend it to anybody. It's kind of the pregame before the football season, which I love. I come to every single game. This is my first fan fest. I'm here with my father, Emmett, and we just decided to just be with other UCF fans and just enjoy the atmosphere of, of UCF football. It's grown substantially since obviously the first one they ever put on. And they're doing more and more to make it all just a very nice event for not only kids, the family and everything, but us <laughs> old alumni. Basically, it's a good chance to bring the kids out and let them walk around the stadium and also to meet the players and meet the coach and just have a good time. I love it all. I mean, I love doing the autographs. I love I love taking pictures with the kids or asking the kids questions, like what sport do they play? And then some of the parents, they, they love that stuff too. I love interacting with them all. I mean, I can't complain about any of it. I love interacting with fans because uh, that just showed them the person who I am. You never know if that fan was having a bad day. If you put that fan in a good mood, that's the importance to me. I keep coming back because, I mean, I'm surrounded by the greatest people on earth. It's all UCF fans, lots of black and gold. Everybody's happy. Everybody's looking forward to two weeks from now. It's critical to UCF's mission to uh, serve the community and be a metropolitan university. And football is a showpiece for anybody's athletic program. So uh, this is a critical part of what we do. It's an introduction to a great time of the year. It's a, another example of a great university serving its metropolitan area.